Hello MacWarriors, how is it going? Welcome to your daily dose of MacWarrior Online. Today I'm playing the Warhammer Hero, the Black Widow, because I wanted to do a very specific loadout. I wanted to try heavy PPCs and machine guns. So, um, the Warhammer Black Widow is the perfect mech for that. And a little disclaimer, you can do a similar build with the Rifleman if you don't want to spend real money on, on, the, on the Warhammer Black Widow. So, um, I'm going to show it to you. Wait. So what we did here is uh, we take two heavy PPCs. We have four light machine guns and two medium lasers as backup. The lasers in the arm because uh, we mainly use them to shoot UAVs. And um, yeah, these are a bit of a stealth defensive weapon. We deal 10 damage close range when something underruns our minimum distance of 90 meters for our heavy PPCs. But other than that and shooting UAVs, the medium lasers are not really good. The thing is um, that we want to open components with the heavies. Uh, they are dealing 30 damage pinpoint combined. They are very tightly together. So uh, if you will take a look at this here, you see um, that the weapon convergence is somewhat good. So they are not really, uh, I mean, uh, in, in one component would be better, but um, they are not too far away from each other. And again, the machine guns are for critting the inner parts of the of the mech then, and uh, then you just win games with that. Running a light engine 300 here, so you can lose a side torso, that's really nice. I only run one ton of LMG ammo because I think it's enough. We have 2,500 rounds for that. That's good enough for uh, four light machine guns. And I'm going to take uh, a targeting computer because first of all, it gives us velocity for our uh, projectiles, for our heavy PPCs. And it gives us a targeting time boost, which is very handy because you want to target the weak spots with the machine guns here. Uh, let's, let me quickly go ahead and uh, talk about the skills here before we uh, take a look at the skill build for or the, the build for the rifleman. As you can see, I went down for a heat generation. This is what I wanted here and velocity. So whenever I found um, a heat gen and velocity node that was easily accessible, I went for it. Uh, I didn't take this here because I was out of nodes and I favored some other nodes here. So. Um, I wanted to have the structure notes um, and I wanted to have the speed tweak, also a cool run and rated deprivation. And I wanted to have two cool shots here yeah, because the build is relatively hot. And uh, again, that leaves me to um, not taking too much into firepower. But again, having heat generation and velocity really, really helps. Now, let me quickly talk about the alternative build on the Rifleman. I'm taking the Rifleman 3C and you have the same or almost the same loadout here. Again, two heavy PPCs in the side torsos, four light machine guns, but you're missing the medium lasers. What I would do here is I'd put a light engine 265 in here, makes the mech reasonably fast. And it is a bit more risky to play actually, because you are uh, lacking the, the backup weapons. So only having two heavy PPCs and, and the light machine guns. But I think this combination here, the, the you know, heavy PPCs, light machine gun combination is is very devastating because it can deal a lot of pinpoint damage and afterwards, you know, the crits are coming in big, big time. So that's the build, the alternative build. I wish you all a lot of fun in the two games that are coming today. And if you have that, as always, don't forget to leave a rating or subscribe. And now it's time to hit the battlefield. All right, first game of the day, we are playing Skirmish on the Grim Plexus. I'm very much looking forward for that because we have a good amount of range on our weapons here and uh, the enemy will probably engage us at mid-range. So we can punch some really big holes into their armor and later on we just crit everything with our machine gun. So this is a component wrecker. We shoot the component, the enemy's component twice, I'd say, and then it should be open and then we can start working on their components with the machine guns. So this is our plan here. A little uh, something that I want to bring up quickly. Uh, as you might tell, I did a little experiment lately, and with lately I mean uh, a long time ago. Uh, I started uh, streaming on Twitch rather than YouTube, and so far it worked out perfectly for me. So Twitch offered me a lot of stuff there. Um, I can connect with you better, I can connect with other streamers, and uh, I did not regret my decision. So um, yeah, as, as per now, I'll continue streaming at Twitch or on Twitch, and uh, if you want to join the streams, then um, yeah, go down below to the description. There's the link to the Twitch page. Uh, I'm streaming on 2 p.m. Central European Summertime, so it's my afternoon. I hope you can still attend. And on Sunday, of course, we are doing the community drops. Very quick shout out for that here. Um, again, I hope to see a lot of you there. Uh, I don't know if you all knew that. Uh, I'm a live streamer as well, and we do some uh, live shenanigans, uh, shenanigans almost each day. So uh, that being said, we want to go to, to to kill the Phoenix Hawk there. Let's go. I mean, they are bound in a fight with our light mechs, and as long as they are kept in position, we can come, at, uh, come over and just kill them. So this is a UAV. Can we kill it? No. Shooting on a run is sometimes difficult, but my, my teams, my teammates got it already. All right. Okay. So Hellbringer is open already. Well, that is uh, some work that my teammates did for me. We have the Phoenix Hawk okay. and the Bushwhacker. Okay, they're reinforcing that position. But again, I'm not afraid. 
I, I have a massive firepower and therefore uh, I'm going to support him. I'm watching the left flank though because I expect more mechs to come to help them. And this is exactly what happens there. Alright, we see an Annihilator and I'm going to shoot him in the head. Ooh, he has BPCs as well and a lot of that. Okay. Yeah, never mind. Never mind, that's a lot of stuff now. Uh, I was a bit too late for the party, so I'm going to retreat. I'm going to find myself another spot. Uh, I'm getting shot a bit by Daka in the back, so my rear is open. Need to take care of that later. And um, yeah, I shall remember that for later, so I won't, you know, just uh, expose my back in a spot where it's not needed. I'm not sure if the hunchback is open already. Um, I missed that, sadly. Let's push right side, guys. Let's flank them. That did not hit? I'm very surprised that that did not hit. Huh. Interesting. Sometimes invisible walls are, you know, what they are. Walls. Okay. That one is down. I want to flank to Fox 4, guys. Are you with me? One or two of you, maybe? And that hit... Wait. wait. What? What? Alright. Okay. I'm going to switch to another target, like that Phoenix Hawk there. What? Did you see that? Wait, am I the worst shot in the world? I mean, I probably am, but there was so many misses. New target. Okay, let's take the steady tar Yeah, steady targets is, uh, is working. No. All right, Destroy. that guy's dead. New I'm gonna shoot him then. And we will start working with our machine guns already. Okay, this is much better, much, much better. Yeah, I'm absolutely sorry for the misses there early. I don't know what happened. Okay. Maybe I should focus more. Helmring is open. Let's uh, try to focus him. Maybe we can take out the side torso, but he's getting rained with missiles already. Oh, let me, let me, remind, let me, let me go. If I want to push, let me push, guys. Don't, st uh, don't block me. Don't stop me in my movement here. Cause that, that's what make me salty. Uh, Victor, it's a uh, tough target. Very much. Uh, lots of armor, so we need to work on that. Nah, I shouldn't do that. I'm just wasting my heat. Again, uh, shooting on the run is sometimes tough. And I'm doing the good old uh, mini NASCAR here. Pop a defensive UAV, this is why I have that. I just don't want anything in my in my back there. Or in my flank or behind me when I'm doing this. That's a summoner. I got this component. Oh, a Hellbringer, okay. No, where's the summoner then? Oh, he's the bushwhacker. Let's kill him. Ah, uh, almost. Almost. But we open him from behind and he's opened in the front as well. So if you can get another shot on him, he should be dead. Where is he? Okay, let's let's use the machine guns then. Here's the Hellbringer. Yeah, it's quite even at the moment. Could, could not believe that that did not hit again. Okay, let's go for the side towards there. It's easier to, to destroy uh, the side than the center. Oh, hello. That's unfortunate. Please let me let me let me move. Let me move. Let me move. Thank you. That was close. Oh my god. <laughs> oh guys, guys, guys. Uh yeah, let's go for uh, I don't know. Supernova. Let's go for it. Side so a crit. I mean that one has no weapons. Uh, oh wait, it has. It's still an ultra. Ah, uh, but let's kill him. Come on. Alright. That worked. Kind of. Can you be crit, please? Okay, we got that. Oh, I don't want to engage this directly. Oh, wait. Uh, he's just standing there? Yeah, he's probably AFK or something like that. What What a weird game, guys. What a weird game. Alright, we just finished off the, the victor there, and then that's it. There's a guy behind us. I'm absolutely sorry again, it was super messy. Sometimes I want to have a, a clean game where I can show you the strength of the build, just uh, as I described them early on. Let's go for leg. And um, I couldn't do it because... wait. Okay. Uh, because something just goes down the drain, I don't know. <laughs> I wanted to show you exactly how precisely open components and then crit them with the machine guns, but it was an utter mess here. But the other mess is a win, and we dealt 750 damage nonetheless, got 4 killing blows, 2 kill most damage dealt, and 10 components. That's okay, and we are going over to the next one right now. Alright, second game of the day, we are playing Skirmish on the Crimson Strait, and I really want to get out of Delta 4. 
<laughs> so scary. The first thing you have to do when you're spawning on this location here on skirmish, you need to run to the platform. Get to the chopper, I say. Get to the chopper. Because uh, the enemy is coming from Delta 6 into Delta 5 and they have the high ground and then they can shoot you while you're trying to reposition and regroup with the team. So I'm, I'm going to show you what I mean. But I'm prepared, guys. I'm absolutely prepared. I have PPCs ready and I want to retaliate if they ever get there in time. Maybe I'm getting getting to cover in time, but uh, let's see. I'm a, a bit scared. It's only mediums and lights that can do that, that can uh, apply the early pressure over there. Um, but we made it. We made it, boys. That's good. So, regrouping. Very important. We are playing skirmish, so the murder ball strategy is highly favored on this mm, game mode here. And I'm actually not sure if this is going to be a saddle push. Wait, we have an, uh, a guy which is narked, so there is another guy, an enemy, over there. Let's go for heat vision. Uh, he popped the UAV, that's good to know. Nah, I wanted that. And yeah, we are just chilling here for a while, I guess. I mean, if anything peaks there, anything, it's getting shot. There he comes. And the thing is, though, um, I'm not too sure if I if I hit that. <laughs> I was a snapshot, and I was uh, I was panicking a bit. Maybe next time I'll focus a bit more. So yeah, he's he's taunting with the flamer. He wants us to peek. There's one guy taunting with a flamer, so uh, that is a bait. We could push them though. If you push all together, we can make something happen there. Absolutely. That's a light make. I shouldn't. Should I? Yeah. Let's try to rebait him. Let's try to rebait him. Uh, I'm going to the right side here because it's a light make. I want to have some distance between me and him. If he's going for me. What? Was it a headshot? Uh, okay. Oh, everybody's here. Everybody's here. Let's push that, guys. Let's push. Go in, go in, go in. Okay, let's go for the rear of the Jenna there. Ooh, hot, hot, hot. Um, what are we focusing? Golf, golf, golf. I want to kill the golf guy. Oh, no, 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 don't go for me. Do I have streamer aggro here? I have streamer aggro. Definitely. Yeah, look at that. Cookie just overheated for that. It was not worth it, man. Absolutely not. Uh, my side also is open. <gasps> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh my god. I'm so bad. Yeah, guys, behind us now, guys. We need to turn around immediately. Oh shit. Uh, let's go for it. They're coming. They're coming. Behind us. Okay. I'm so sorry for the rear shot there. I shot my rifleman in the back. Did I? New target acquired. I don't know. Okay. Good thing is I can now stay here at my Overwatch position and kill the guy. Um, I don't see him anymore. Yeah, I have a cool shot still. New target acquired. We should counter push there. Oh, there he is. New target acquired. Okay. Um, yeah, about that. I'm, I'm absolutely sorry, guys. Uh, but that sometimes happens. Okay, we got him. I'm going for chain fire here. I don't know why. Uh, could you? Okay, I'm going for this then. Ah, uh, it's one of the last enemies. We pinned him down. No, we didn't pin him down. Oh, yes, they didn't. Jenna. I like myself. I killed myself. Um, yeah. Um, it was a bad round. But anyway, I'm giving it to you. Because maybe you can learn something. Um, I overheated here because I wanted to get the kill. I was greedy. So it wasn't really a point holding back here. And um, therefore, <clears throat> yeah. That. Um, again, focus. Focus is what you need. Uh, sometimes. So yeah. Um, we got, I guess, a headshot for some reason, and then afterwards we got uh, a bit of team damage. But it was a nice push here, so going to the saddle was the right call. And um, we made it to the end game. <laughs> Alright, guys. Um, you will get this game here because I'm a bit on a tight schedule. I want to catch up to my schedule and get some some of my videos going here. Yeah, I want to have uh, a bigger backlog, and therefore you will get this with uh, 500, 450. Uh, no, 545 damage. Uh, we got one killing blow, nine assists, two kills damage dealt, 
Uh, we got one component destroyed, we got uh, suicide, we got a lot of team damage. 41, I'm sorry for that. But yeah, we won the game in the end because my team just worked together. That's your daily dose for today. I hope you liked the video. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating or subscribe to the channel. And I hope to see you on the battlefield. Goodbye.